Hi guys, I'm Juliana. And I'm in the driver's seat. And I'm Zach, and I'm in the back seat. This is Cube. And we're doing it wrong. Alright, so last time we left off, we had these lovely frickin' things that we yeah, have we're to... Yeah, we're in a, a weird, darker area of place. Yeah, we've it's started... Still... Yeah, it started getting weird. Dude. Okay. So... Okay. okay, there's your magnet. if the magnet's on the ground? Nothing. So they only move laterally. Good to know. Yeah. So I'm trying to see what we want to do. Um, so there's that. Okay, so this one... They kind of line up, I guess. So we need to move that one this way. And, and we just can't touch them. Of yeah, we course. can't directly move them. We need to use the magnet. So I'm going to do this one first, because it seems the easiest. Okay. Alright, and you're... Actually, I think you're on the right track already. Turn that off. Okay. Yep, update that up. Now... I'm going to get over here. Yep. So, make your life easier. Extend the red one on the way. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Now, we're gonna need time. The yellow one. Because yeah. where does it? It needs to be there. So it needs yeah. to be to be on the center. Yeah, so, um, I'm gonna rotate the magnet. Okay. So I think if you Damn it. So I think it needs to be on top of there's not really a good way to do that with this one. Um, oh. So, like... <sighs> okay. So, this is a really timing delicate one. Uh, yes. Um, you want to get... I mean, I've lined it up pretty much. All you got to do is... Yeah. This one's pretty much on it. Mm -hmm. All that has to happen is we need to get this one just a little bit. Yes, and over. what needs to happen is the center one needs to be the longest. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay. So, That's on I, you. With, so, turn the magnet on, real quick. Here? Yes, turn that magnet on. Now, shrink it. Shrink the yellow down to the wall. Yeah, because it's on... Yeah, because it doesn't do that, so... Um... So... Have it go the up. only the only other way to make that work is to have the magnet on, and then pull it over one, and then drop it, and then pull it back. So I'll I'll show you what I mean. Um, okay. Have it here. So that then, that wasn't even the right space. That's not the right level, because it threw it out when you launched it up. So that's what you need to do. You need to have it go up until it's on the the next tier up. 
Oh, okay. Um, so... Because as long as it activates it, it's fine. But it's the only way I'm going to get it done. So just. Well, I'm. Okay. Okay. So you have it. Yeah, I know. I, I need to do this. Yes. Here. Cool. Now, I don't need to worry about that one. That one will just. That one is where it needs to be. What you need to do is you need to... Nope. There you go. Maybe. What? How the fuck? Oh. You have to... Be in the line. To, at the very last second, as soon as it bumps out like that, you need to rotate the magnet so it's on that wall. So do that. Get the magnet on that wall so the cube will go over there. Shorten the red one and extend it. Yeah, that's what I was... I just realized that. So what needs to happen is the green cube needs to be on the ground. The, okay. green, the green cubes need to be on the ground. So turn the magnet on. Turn it back on so it's all the way. Okay. So what needs to happen is you need to have the, the magnet on the ceiling. And then you're going to turn it on and you're going to as soon as that lines up you're going to Click to extend the yellow one, and then switch the magnet so it's on the wall you're facing. Okay. All right. Sorry guys, I just don't have the like the quick You don't have the dexterity. I do not have the dexterity points for this. I 
I'm wondering if it has to be in the in the white line. How do you mean? Because see, that only appears when A, it's in line, but B, it's also in line with the white line. So it's acting as a reflector. It's acting as a refractor. Reflector. Well, it's, it's, it's bending the light. Yeah, sorry. It's been a long day. I was going to say, come on, physics major. Uh, excuse you. Hey, no. 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 You don't say. I think we've mentioned it once or twice. Yeah. Well, just, just for we have a cat. Yeah. He makes his presence known. Regularly. God damn. Right? Well, the fact that it requires such a long time before you can actuate it again is kind of fucking ridiculous. You can't just, like, click, click. You can't turn it on and off real quick. That's really fucking stupid. That and then that. Ah! Okay, okay, we got it. I think we found the level that broke us. Look it up. How to do it? I, I think we both know what needs to be done and how it needs to be done. Oh! Oh! Got it. Yes. Do, 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 do. I didn't break it this time. I'm just pointing that out. I did not break it. I haven't got much power left, so open your ears. Doubt is like a tiny plant trying to push its way towards the light. But as soon as she sees it poking out of the dirt, she pours on more soothing words to kill it. You're making the cube fall apart. You're going to get to talk to your wife. You're going to get out. You're going to go home. You're going to save the whole earth. That's her poison. And you're drinking it. If you want it to stop, you have to stop it. So that makes me wonder, like, who this other person is and how they're involved. So, um, I know Zach totally missed that, that message. Was there? Oh, God damn. Um, but, you know, talking about how doubt is this plant and, and how our, our, um, person at the International Space Station is, is using, like, light and hope as, um, as, as her poison in which to kill her and to, to kill him and destroy the cube and he'll get to talk to his wife, he'll get to save the Earth and all this other stuff. Which is great, and I get her point, but I'm also going, or get his point, but I'm also going with, if I'm really a prisoner here, why would I not want to destroy the prison I am in? Even if it means my death. Its destruction would be better served than to torment others. It sounds, but it sounds to me like that they're only putting one person in these cubes at a time. Correct. And they're not. And he was also saying something about his power was running out. So, like, as as the cube is doing that as well, it makes me question, like, if it is the cube itself speaking to him or something relying upon the cube and its torment of others. Because it, it is essentially a prison. I don't care how oh, well we no, sugarcoat it. You're correct. And we are essentially either voluntarily or not a prisoner here. Mm -hmm. Um, so the, the question becomes, should I destroy it or let it go? And my thought is, is if I am here as a prisoner, fuck the system. <laughs> okay, so. That one turned black. That, yes, I noticed that. No. There we go. Blackout mode. Oh dear. Uh, okay, so that means free fall. Likely. Uh, if we're losing power, that would explain a lot. Oh, 
I'm blue now. That is just dark. Or we're blue now. No, thank you. Oh, oh, it was behind you. I have faith you can hear me. It's going crazy out there. The outside of the cube is coming away in big chunks. It's incredible. You're doing really, really great. <laughs> no word on talking to your wife yet, but it'll happen very soon. Don't worry. Light. Other than that, no news at my end. No, like they were interested. I figure talking to you is therapeutic. Especially for me, actually. What I said before about how being alone out here can mess with you. It's messed with me, too. I can't talk to Mission Control about it, or they'd cut me short. I figure, with your radio out, <sighs> Fifteen days ago, I was on a spacewalk on the outside of the station. I was replacing one of the old communication antennas. The sun was disappearing over the western edge of the Earth behind me. And it gets so quiet out there, so dark. Sometimes you can't be sure you're there at all. I finish the job, I start to move away. And, uh, and I hear this voice. Only, it's my voice. Not in my mouth. Not in my head, but outside, next to my ear. It's the only way I can explain it. And the voice, it said... It said... God is dead. <laughs> It scared the hell out of me. I suppose that could be upsetting. I grabbed my tether and pulled myself back into the airlock and shut the door. I know it's just my brain keeping itself busy. And that's why we do isolation tests before we go out. But Christ. I'm orbiting out of range. I'm sorry. Keep going. Please keep going. Well, I think the more traumatizing thing is hearing your own voice. <laughs> yes, definitely. Like completely out of body, not not yeah. your own inner monologue that you always have going. Mm -hmm. But hearing yourself, mm -hmm. not from your mouth, not from a recording you can see, but hearing yourself here, and you know no one else is around. Yeah, that would. And you know the another way that could be taken is uh, other than God is dead is the self is dead. Yeah. Uh... Uh, you know, and, and whatever, the soul, whatever you want to call it, that's another way that could be construed. So, just because, you know, we take issue with the wording used, sometimes mm -hmm. you can find other more other ways. Yeah. Okay, well, there's broken reds now. Oh, you gotta connect the circuit. There you go. Whoa. Right. Oh, look, another elevator. Well, did you notice how, unlike the last time, it, where it was all, like, in line, we started seeing, like, Packs and yep. chimps and like, like they weren't quite aligned. Mm -hmm. I did notice that. Yeah, that's why I kept looking around and kind of Things trying to point it out. Just.
grab the sword and swing. tell guys I, by my my reaction to well she's lying to you okay and you're not lying to me <laughs> what have you got that she's not yeah she's lying to you and you're not I'm kind of okay with so, fucking the system okay. and find me. something that works okay so there's that one there no. what's up <laughs> I did a thing. Yes. That one. Activate the blue. Now, activate the blue. Get the yeller. Or one of them. Now you need to get the reds on the other side. Oh, I did it. I got one of them. So now you just need to get that last one. So you need to... I think you need to send it all the way back, yeah. yeah. And then raise the one that's there. So yeah, raise that one all the way up. And it's... Forward. Yeah. And I think it's just such that it'll... Yep. Boink. Now actually that. Shh. Yeah, boom. You go. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, yep. Yep. Neat. Okay. Oh, that looks fun. Not sure how I feel about those. I see them as dangerous until proven otherwise. Yeah. Like most things in life, dangerous until proven otherwise. Not deadly, but dangerous. Okay, so where's that? There we go. Now there's another one. Go see what it does so you know where you're going and you're not just flying blind. Dork. Oh, that might do it. What? Motherfucker. What? It 
Instead of sending it in here, block it. Oh, god damn it. Okay. And now out and in and drop. Do that. That. Drop. Drop. Is your blue one down? Yes. There we go. And now it's red. Whee! Hey, we got it finally. Sorry about that. Oh, gosh. Oh. Are you down? That sounds right. It's down. One. Okay. Alright. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let us know if we're doing it wrong in the comments below. And I'll see you next time. Catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Do a little.